So today I'm going to show you your dicing attachment that comes with your Cuisinart food processor. So what we're going to do is remove the lid. Now this is the dicing kit and your flat cover that comes with your product goes on top just um, for compact storage, but we don't need that to use the dicing attachments. We'll put that aside. This is your um, cutting mechanism. This is your dicing disc, and you can see how it's all perfectly square. You're gonna put this in your food processor with the dicing grid facing the front. And next you're gonna put in your, your disc that is the cutting mechanism, like so. Always hold it by the hub. Put your lid on and then twist it to lock it into place. The other thing I want to show you, this, has, um, this helps you get any extra food out of your um, dicing grid when you are um, done working. So what we're going to do is remove the feed tube. We're going to put in a potato so you can see how this works. And the great thing about this is like it quickly and easily will cut up the potato so that you can make things like hash browns really easily. And you'll notice that it stops when I remove it. Okay, so let's put some onion in because obviously if you're making hash browns, you're going to want to put a little um, onion in there for flavor. Just put that like that. Let's uh, try another potato. Like so. So let me take it apart so you can see it. going to set this in here just so it's out of the way. So you can see how beautiful that this, the dices came out for the potatoes and also the onion. And the great thing about this is if you're not very efficient with a knife or you don't have really great knife skills and you want to get really uniform cuts on your um, food items, you can make fruit salads, you can make hash browns. There's so many different things that you can do with the dicing attachment for your Cuisinart food processor.